there. Y'all got to excuse me. I just had my teeth pulled. I'm not feeling too good. We're waiting for this setup for this trade right here that I'm keep missing. Gonna run two contracts on this one. We can try to get it in at nine dollars if we can. I'm gonna let it come back on me just a little bit here. I'm gonna wait to see what's gonna happen here. Mm, don't like that. Oh, no, I like that. Don't like that. Mm. Coming back against me right now. I'm not in the trade yet. I'm trying to get it at nine dollars if I can. I'm gonna run two contracts on this one. I really believe it'll get to this line here before it does anything. I got a couple more minutes I could wait now. I know I can get it for nine right now. Let me see how my level two looking on it. Yeah, so that that's definitely good. Let's see if it'll bounce off this line. If not, if not, we'll switch directions. It's 15 minutes, it ain't setting up the way I want it to set up. Mmm. Oh man, it's numbing. What you call that stuff? They numb your teeth up with. Anesthesia is starting to wear off. I'm getting in a little pain. Now, if this 15 minute close underneath that, we'll take it down to that. If it close under 62, we're waiting to see. If, it's, if it close under 62, we're going to just switch sides. That's it. You know, one good thing about options, you don't care. As long as it goes up and down, let's see what's going to happen. I can't talk as much because my mouth is hurting. And um <clears throat> we got five minutes. Look like it's not gonna close underneath there. One minute, thirty seconds. Let's see. Let's see what's gonna happen here. Let me get back to my setup. Let's see, didn't do it. Didn't close underneath that line. This line is still pretty strong. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to I guess I missed that one. See what's gonna happen. I got lower to low seven. It's coming down. This is coming down. I should be able to get it nine ten, but somebody asked nine ten. Gonna have to wait now. See what's gonna happen with this fifteen minute candle. I just leave this one alone. It's not setting up the way I want it to set up. I should get to that line right there. I think I could have got cheaper for this. I'm gonna pull it at 920. We in this trade at 920. Just saw oh, shit. I didn't take it. 
Let's see, can we get it cheaper there? Okay, we in the trade at 920. Just complete it. I want to see it get to this line right here. Get to that line right there. I'm out at that trade. Let me get my set ready. We got in the 920. So wait, see what's happening. There we go. Keep going. Oh, you fuck, fuck me running. Uh, excuse my language, I forgot this thing's recording almost. See what's going to happen. Everything looks good to go up right now. Want to make sure I keep my eye on my. A lot of times when I trade, I keep my eye, I put my stuff right here so I can keep my eye on what's going on. That's going against me right now and I don't like it, but I keep my eye right here to see what's going on just to make sure everything is running smooth. I guess I was right, I could have got it for nine. I don't like that setting up. I got to get out of this trade now because it's starting to come against me. 890. The reason why I'm about to get out of this trade because I'm not like how this starting to set up to go the opposite way. Let me get out of that one. I'm going to take a loss on that one. I'm out of that trade. The reason why I got out of that trade so fast is because you better start paying attention to your setups. But I missed that one. I got out of that one. When you do this long enough, you're going to start seeing setups that don't look right. And if they don't look right, you better get out as fast as possible. Like, you see, I just setting up right there. And then I went right back here to my um, 30. And I, I wanted to stay close to this, but remember, you got to play by the, by the minute. That means that 30 really didn't get up to where it's needed to get up to. So I'd be crazy to stay in that trade. You know, I'd rather take that $50 loss right there than stick around for that trade because see, what, watch what's going to happen here. See, this is still not coming up, so now you got a good possibility of that thing going the opposite way. So let's look at the 15 minute. I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. See how that's starting to go down? So now this is going to be my new price target. You know, on that 15 minute. Now that 15 minute is gonna drop. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna switch gears on this trade and see can we pick something up on the other end, which is right in this area. See there? That's why you get out of that trade. Now you see why I jumped out of that trade so fast. Once you start seeing the wrong setup. Get out of that trade. Do not stay in that trade. Remember, we got in at 920. We lost $40 into that trade. So I got out fast because I seen that setup coming. And if you ever see that setup start to transpire, you really need to understand how to do candlesticks and price action. You really need to know this is the reason why I don't take big losses. Right here. Right there. That's the reason why I don't take big losses. I will see a setup coming. Once I see that setup going the opposite way, I get out of that trade. See what I'm saying? See how it's still dropping? And see? That's why you get out of that trade. You get out of that trade. Now I'm going to switch gears. I wanted to break underneath this line and I'll be back in that trade. But that's for this one for right now. Green Bulls, Red Bears. Sorry about the two fake. Sorry with me mumbling. Bye.